Captain McDonald leading the horses to the post. Race number four, second division of the CKG Billings Amateur Trot, racing one mile, a purse of $2,250. Field of eight, there are no changes. Number one is Fox Valley Trump. Well, by Joe Panaccio of Boca Raton, Florida, Dave Myrick trains, Joe Panaccio drives. The two is China Score, all by Fuller of Newark, Terry Van Roden trains, Ed Ryan driving. Three Armbro Marino, all by Bill and Nancy Myers of Dayton, Ohio, Randy Owens trains with Joe Ferraldo. The four self imposed, owned, trained, and driven by Dr. L. Gobble. Five is Doorbuster, owned by the Hatfield Stables of Columbus, Tim Rucker trains with Bud Hatfield. Number six, Crown Jeweler, owned by Harold Breidenbaugh of Lima, Ohio. Harold Dick Trains, Harold Breidenbaugh Drives. The seven, Chicory Mitch, Shelby Glenwood and Retta McNeil of Charlotte, Michigan. Marshall Macon Trains with Greg Cuddell. The eight, Pepper Corn, over the Homestock Farms of Millersburg, Ohio. Martha Wagers Trains, driven by Mr. Ben Miller. Win play show perfecta, pick three wagering, seven minutes until post time. Second division, the CKG Billings Amateur Trot, slotting up, moving in. On the back stretch, there they go. And uh, they're off, and it's Ombro Moreno who surges early for the lead from the inside and second, Fox Valley Trump. From the far outside and third, it's Chicory Mitch, and from between horses comes Door Buster. At the rail, a racing in five. It's self-imposed. Looking to angle in sixth now comes Pepper Corn. At the rail and trotting in seventh as he round the first turn. It's China score. The early trailer is Crown Jeweler. Slugging it out early on the front end here on the inside with a lead. It's Fox Valley Trump, the opening quarter, 28 seconds. On the outside, Chicory Mitch Keitel wants the front end here, but on the inside, Ombro Marino won't let him go, and these two are head-to-head -head now as they race through the stretch. It's Chicory Mitch on the outside, and Ombro Marino at the rail. Fox Valley Trump behind the battling leaders in third, and then Doorbuster gapping two lengths in fourth, followed by Self-Imposed in fifth. Peppercorn has found a seat, sixth on the inside. At the rail in seventh is China Score. The uh, trailer is Crown Jeweler, the half, 57 and 1. And Ombro Marino has put away Chicory Mitch, who's fading now to the outside. That gives Fox Valley Trump room to race, but he'll wait on the inside behind the leader. Door Buster is now third at the rail, with self imposed in fourth. Chicory Mitch continues to fade now, fifth. Now the back stretch into the final turn, and there goes Fox Valley Trump. One quick, decisive move takes a lead here. Fox Valley Trump to the front end by two. Three quarters, one, 27 and four. And it's Fox Valley Trump now by three. Inside and second, John Bomarino and Doorbuster Hatfield will have to hurry. Time is running close here, but on the inside, it's still Fox Valley Trump by three and a half, four. And Doorbuster is second on the outside. John Bomarino is still a game third. With less than a 16th, no one's going to catch Fox Valley Trump and uh, Joe Panaccio. It's Fox Valley Trump, Doorbuster, and self imposed now battling for the second spot. It's Fox Valley Trump in 157 and 1. Here is the official winner, number one, Fox Valley Trump, a five year old Illinois bred son of Master Willie. Held by Joe Panaccio of Boca Raton, Florida, Dave Myrick trains Joe Panaccio in the Sonki. Fox Valley Trump recording his sixth of the season, his fastest win of the year, 157 and 15. The complete order finish, Fox Valley Trump the winner, China score five, Ombro Marino four, self-imposed three, Doorbuster two, Crown Jeweler seven, Chicory Mitch eight, and Peppercorn six, 154-327-8. And is six. The upcoming of fifth race, there are no changes. Win play show perfected twin trifecta wagering, no changes for the upcoming fifth. 